Hey everyone, my name is Simsy. How you all doing? Welcome back to some more AFL 23 here today on the channel with episode 8 of my Richmond Management Career Series here today. We've hit finals, baby. We've managed to finish this first season atop of the league, winning the minor premiership. And now we have our finals campaign. We've been drawn against Port Adelaide. Let's go. All right, so here is the ladder for you guys who didn't see it in the last episode. Sydney finished in second, Brisbane third, Adelaide fourth, Melbourne in fifth, the Western Bulldogs in sixth, North Melbourne in seventh, and Geelong in eighth. Unfortunately, Collingwood and Essendon miss out on percentage. And Jack Revolt ends the season winning the goal kicker uh, with Rioli just behind him. But here we go. First round of finals. Obviously, we have a second chance. So, regardless if we lose this one, um, we're okay. But we actually beat Port Adelaide <laughs> at the last game of the season. So, we got form against them. But a lot of our boys are back. Vlosten's now back in the mix. And we're going to be hosting Port Adelaide at the MCG. After beating them by, it was like four or five goals away in Adelaide Oval. So they do have a very solid list, a decent midfield and forward line, but their defense lets them down quite a bit. But here we go. Massive opportunity here today to potentially book ourselves a place in one of those elusive prelim slots. Or otherwise, we're going to have to come back next week. And I don't know who will reverse. But here we go. Richmond. Can we make the prelim? Let's go. Looking to move it on quickly. Rioli. There's a lot of targets in there. We couldn't find one, man. I was talking smack about oh, Adelaide's defense. And they get a pretty decent intercept mark, but they give it away there. Bolton tie oh, centralizes it to, to Taranto. And he has a golden opportunity for this match. Haven't seen much of Taranto this season. Been more of a fan of Hopper, both in real life and in this game. But Taranto steps up and scores the first goal for the Tigs. The Tigers go a goal in front. Still first quarter. Oh, dropped there on the wing. Port Adelaide have the footy clearly. Drilling it to the left of screen. Port Adelaide... Quickly give it and go. Nankervis in the defense. It's spoiled. It's a boiling footy. Someone try and get it out. Port Adelaide turn and react. And they get one back. The power comes surging forward. Is that Fantasia? <laughs> uh, great to see him back into the side. He is just so injury prone in real life. He's hardly there half the time. I'm sure Essendon fans... I <laughs> would be so happy <laughs> with that trade from back in the day. He just doesn't play. He's a wicked player. Play or Fantasia, whatever you say. <laughs> I've always said Fantasia. <laughs> I don't think I'll skip it at that. Only a point, though. Oh, no. I'm talking smack about Fantasia. And they get one back. Only a goal game. Need a switch on. Second quarter. Richmond. Need to get back into this one. Good clearance. Hopper. Bolton. Can someone get the footy out? Short somehow does. Pick it. Only as far as Lynch coming forward. Turns and goes. Richmond react. Lightning quick. And it's a one point game for the Tigers. Super, super close this one. Port Adelaide looks super up for it. Koshi, furious somewhere. Second quarter still. We go again. We want to get another goal after that good momentum. Bolton goes bang. Trying to find Martin. The footy's being spilt. Richmond, just get it out. Cumberland. Come on. Oh, what a goal. Whew. Richmond get one back. Thanks to Cumberland, actually. He stepped up in this finals campaign. 
Still super close this match. Port looking to bring it in. Oh, somehow <laughs> released the footy. I don't even know how. Oh, come on. We can't gift them a goal here. Broad. Solid defense. No, man. They he was nowhere near me, man. Get out with that. And Port Adelaide to bring things back within a point. They shoot. They score. The Tigers could be out here if we're not careful. Super duper close, this one. Oh, Lynch couldn't get to it. Port Adelaide trying to bring it out from the back. Oh, short with an amazing intercept mark in the third. Trying to find Cumberland. He's found Taranto, who has really stepped up in this fixture. Taranto to put the Tigers a goal in front for his second. He shoots, he scores, he does it. What an outstanding performance this man is having here today. Taranto, the former GWS giant, kicks the goal. Fourth quarter now. It's a one-goal game. The Tigers... Trying to get another. Holding the, ball. Holding the ball. Port Adelaide. They sniff a late winner. Bolter with the interception. Plays it quick. Sometimes the best form of defense is attack. As the Tigers go forward. Lynch is in the goal square. Lynch! Oh, I'm nervous. I'm frantic. I'm frazzled. Tom Lynch. With an opportunity to put the Tigers in with a prelim. Oh, he does. He kicks it home. It's two goals late in this fourth quarter. And the Tigers might be able to make the prelim this season. If they just hold on just that little bit longer. Bang. Come on. Sound the siren. Lynch just fires into an open goal square. It's not going to make the distance. But the Tigers are going to win the match against Port Adelaide. Two matches against Port Adelaide back to back. And we continue this finals campaign. The Tigers victorious here today. What a result. And we've made the prelim. So who are we going to be drawn against? I can't wait to see, I suppose. So we'll play the prelim here now, Fantasia Evans with one. So let's skip forward, I suppose. So could be anyone. Oh, it's going to be the Lions, a team we got smacked by early in the season. My former team, the Lions make the prelim. Well, let's play this one here today. At the MCG, Lockie Chockey Neal, Toby Nankervis up there. Here we go. My former side, who I won the flag with in the Premiership last season before I took the Richmond job. And now, here we go. They're going to be playing in their away kit, which I kind of like. I actually like the lighter maroon. It's more of an orange, eh? But here we are. Richmond facing the old schoolboys from Fitzroy. Here we go. Let's get things underway. Prestia looking to play it quick. Cumberland finds a target maybe of Rioli. And he does. Rioli. Looking to put his name on the score sheet. Oh, you beauty. Seconds into this match with Richmond's first opportunity in the forward 50. They've been a goal here. Lions, a little bit shell-shocked in this match as Richmond have the first. The Lions go on the wing. Grimes can't get the interception. Is that going to be 50? It is. Ah, oh, well, it's a free kick a bit further. Oh, that's ridiculous, but okay. Jack steps up. Miss. It's actually Lion. 
Lions, actually. The Lions miss as Vlosten's back into the side after his career. Basically, at the start of the year, he picked up a pretty bad injury. He hasn't been, he's been out for the majority of the season. Oh, the Lions bring one back here, though. And who's this? Oh, it's Lockie Neal. Chocky with a good goal. Second quarter now. Brisbane lead by a point. Winning the majority of this pat match. A broad comes up. Wins it. Broad. Trying to find Taranto. Find someone in the end. Come on. Get it out. Revolt. Bolton, get it up. Come on, please. Someone finish it. Far out. It's taken a really crummy sort of goal, but Short's going to claim it in the end. The Tigers by a goal. The Lions wanting to pounce and get back into this match. Bolter tries to find the run of Revolt. Can't. Rioli gets it. Go on, Jack. Nice. We've got a lot of opportunities here. He's just going to put it to the goal square. Oh, Nankervis somehow gets it out, but we nearly didn't there. Two goals. Still super, super close in this match. Tackled in the box in the end. Rioli looking to bring it out from the back for Richmond. Going to go for the wing. Not going to risk going down the corridor. Lynch comes up to collect. Lynch basically just puts it to the boundary. And it's going to be a throw in ultimately from that. Still two goal lead. The Tigers. Oh, Taranto is looking so good. He's been wicked in these last couple of matches. Bolton out of nowhere with a little bit of individual brilliance. What a magnificent goal there from Shea Bolton. Clutch player. And the Tigers lead the Lions by three. But there's still plenty of football left in this match. Baker can't get the intercept. And the Lions, with Zach Bailey here, looking to get his first. Uh, and he does. It's online. Yeah, Zach Bailey, never going to miss from there. The Tigers hold on to a narrow, a very, very narrow and small two-goal lead. All to play for here at the MCG. Either side deserving to win. Oh, the Lions look good. Unafraid to go down the corridor. Lynch on the mark. Happy to switch it to the next wing. Oh, good in. Wait, Baker, just go. Don't even worry about, like, going back over the mark. Just go. Lynch. We've pushed a lot of players forward. We need to capitalize on this. I'm just going to hammer it at the goal square and try and hope that it finds someone. Go. Go on. Oh, Martin. It's been spilt at the back. And now it's three goals. Can Richmond book their place in the grand final? Or will we have to wait till next year? It's going to be a nail-biting final quarter. Fourth quarter now. Three goal lead. Brisbane haven't been afraid to score in this game. But Revol comes up. Oh. Please. Please, please, please. Jack. My Tasmanian brother. <laughs> You've got to convert this one. And he does. It's four goals. And the Tigers look more likely than the Lions to book a place in the AFL Grand Final. 
I wonder who that could be against. What a goal. Bang. The Lions not down and out for the count just yet. They want to try and save some face. Baker uh, spills it. Oh, Richmond actually recover incredibly well. Short. Uh, Rowley, come on. Couple good handballs there. Richmond playing some wicked footy this season. That's what I wanted to see. High octane, high energy, and just really encouraging Richmond footy. Look at this. We've got so many options here. Hopper might be able to go all the way. <laughs> He's ran too far. <laughs> oh, we somehow got it out. Go on, Dusty. Go on. We're going to have to have a shot. <laughs> He's going to get run down by Rich. Oh, but it's opened up here. It's a five-goal lead. And we've managed to get some revenge of the Lions earlier in the season and obviously in that final uh, years ago but what a result Richmond make the AFL grand final wow look at that what a good game that was that was uh, so so much fun Neil Bailey Martin Nankervis, Bolton, Rioli. All right. Well, unfortunately, on that note, it's time to end the video here. Thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned for episode nine coming out the exact same time tomorrow as we're going to have the AFL Grand Final. I wonder who it's going to be against. I'm curious to see. But like and subscribe if you haven't already. Let me know feedback and suggestions in the comments. Would you, I guess, depending on the result tomorrow uh would you like to see season two of this richmond career series or should we move on to something else let me know but yeah like and subscribe uh make sure to take care of yourselves have a fantastic rest of your day if you want to see more from me check out the videos on screen thank you so much for watching my name has been simsy and i will see you in the next one cheers